hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new so in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to fix app not installed problem on android i'm going to be giving you guys three methods on how you'd go about resolving this issue so if you're interested stick around for the rest of the video so for method one you're going to open settings and go to apps after which you're going to click on the three dots in the upper right hand corner of the screen and select show system apps so once that is done the next thing you'd want to do is scroll down until you find package installer and after you've found it you would simply click on it select for stop and then click on ok next after you've done that you'd want to go to storage and clear the data and catch and that completes step one. So now we're moving on to step two. So for method two, you'd want to go to Play Store. And after you've opened the Play Store app, you'd simply tap on the burger icon or the menu icon. Then you'd select Play Protect. So once you've tapped on Play Protect, you would then select the settings icon in the top right hand corner of the screen. And you'd simply turn off Play Protect. So what Play Protect does is that it inhibits apps that are harmful from for the app to be downloaded. So once you've turned it off, you could simply download the app and then you would turn it on after you've finished installing the app. So that completes method three. If you still haven't found a method that works for you, I have one final method. So stick around. So now for method three, what you'd want to do is to... Go to settings, after which you'd go to about phone, which is usually at the bottom of the screen. And then you'd select software info to check which Android version you have. So I have Android version 6.0 in my phone. So once you've done that, you would go and open a browser and type in the app you want to download with the Android version in your device. So for example, I'm going to be using... CapCut and I'm just simply typing in CapCut version 6.0 and then I would see a list of options of CapCut that is compatible with my device. If these methods do not work for you then the app may not be compatible with your device any at all. So that's the end of the video. If you enjoyed this video please leave a like, comment and share. Also, please turn on your post notifications so you'll be notified whenever I upload videos. Thank you so much for watching.